I'm down here in Escalante, Utah, southern Utah, and staying at the Escalante Escapes. These are uh, modern tiny homes. There's nine of them, over four acres, and they're all so beautiful, modern, open floor plan. I can't wait to show you what ours looks like inside. So we are staying in the King Loft, the Hollyhock, and this one does sleep four people. It has a master bedroom, a um, sofa pull-up couch, and can sleep four people with one bathroom. So I'm gonna start on the outside and show you guys how cool this patio is. Check this out. Oh my gosh, so pretty. You have your own private fire pit, Adirondack chairs. A nice view and we're just gonna come on up to the deck and check this out so you have two more chairs up here and a barbecue so total again four people can stay here here's your view your neighbors are really close to you but for some reason this still still feels very secluded so I don't think that's going to be an issue and Nobody else is actually here yet on a Friday night, so we'll see if any neighbors show up. Let's take a look inside. Wow, this is a beautiful modern layout inside this tiny house. I love all the color of the wood. This kitchen is just so pretty. Um, dishwasher, coffee maker, nice uh, deep farm style basin. You've got your cooktop stove here, plenty of storage, and the refrigerator and microwave. The one thing that we are noticing it does not have is an oven, so don't plan to bake anything while you're here or you know have a like take home pizza or anything like that. Um, you will have to cook it on the stove top or microwave it. And here's just another view from the kitchen into the living room area with the deck out back. So pretty and open. All these windows really help bring in a lot of light. So this particular model is actually their smallest square footage wise. It's only 370 square feet, but check this out. It even has a washer and dryer, so that's pretty nice. Especially if you were staying here for like several nights and you needed to wash all of your hiking gear, your clothes, um, what a great place to, to do it and just have it be right here where you're staying. We're gonna take a look into the bathroom next. So again, they've gone with the really open light colored um, concept. The glass shower doors really make this shower feel bigger than it is. And it has an actual flushing toilet. Um, a lot of tiny homes will have like a sawdust style toilet, so it's real. <laughs> I know some people want real, real toilets and in this closet is um, just the water heater. So yeah, very spacious bathroom. Very surprised at how big this actually feels. Okay, last but not least is the king bedroom. Wow, I can't believe they fit so much in here. They've made it feel so open and very spacious. I mean, this is such a livable space. This is awesome. All these windows definitely help the light colored wood. All of this is just amazing. I'm so excited to stay in this for the next two nights. Um, over the next two days, we're gonna go and do some hikes. Um, the Escalante escapes, all of the um, tiny houses are really close to Capitol Reef if you head north, or Bryce National Park if you were to head west. So there's so much hiking to do in the area. I will say the one downside of this, and you guys know I bring my dog everywhere, but they don't allow dogs. So we did leave Charlie with a friend for the weekend. 
Um, we're still gonna hit up some of the dog friendly trails just so I can come back and maybe bring Charlie back. I think he would absolutely love doing the hikes that we're planning to do. So I hope you guys enjoyed the tour of the tiny home. Make sure you get your reservations a few weeks in advance. Um, they do tend to fill up. And I will say prices vary by season too. So the off season is definitely cheaper, in season is more expensive. So the further out that you can make your reservation, the better to get the price that you want. So make sure you go to the link right here and get your reservation set up today so you can come stay in this beautiful place. Thank you Escalante Escapes. We're so excited to stay here the next two nights.